This guitar is arguably the most iconic Telecaster in Fender history. It was used during the Let It Be recording sessions and the final Beatles performance on the rooftop. So we spec out the guitar, take it all apart, as we do with these projects, and we measure everything to find out all the little things that make it tick and, and to kind of set aside all the rumors and hearsay about what the guitar used to be and, and what it was and how it was made. And, and so I actually had it there to answer all those questions that were there. The challenge is to find the wood that looks like the original wood, and that's, that's, a, that's a huge challenge. We ordered enough for 300 guitars just so that we could sort the material to find all the pieces that we need. It's actually a four-piece rosewood body with a maple seam that holds the sandwich together. And then it's a two-piece late 60s style neck and fingerboard with a round lamb. And it's all 68 specs on this guitar as it was when it was made. I asked Abby if she would come out of retirement and spin me some pickups for this project only. So they'll all be hand signed and dated by Abby. It's in the details, that's, that's where we really excel in the custom shop, is just, just dissecting everything and making every detail perfect. The whole project has been based on making the guitar look and feel, play and sound how it would have the day that George got it. And so for me, it's like a great deal of pride to be able to be a part of this project. You know, that's what everyone wants. Everyone wants the George Telly. And this is it. <laughs>